And with this, I'm sold. <laughs> Listen to this bass. Damn, man, that sounds cool. Excite Audio, new brand that I just discovered with their new plugin called Lifeline, and it's full of really cool effects. Let's take a listen. Hello everyone, welcome back to Mixbest TV. Hope you're having a great day. Before we start, please check the info box down below for my mixing courses on ProMix Academy, free plugins, special discounts and offers, and of course, linked to Excite Audio Lifeline Expanse, today's plugin, which is on sale at the time of this video. And if you want to support the channel, but most important, if you really want to learn how to mix and master professionally, click the join button down here, become a Mixbest TV member, access the already big and always growing library of full professional mixing courses, start to finish on many, many genres. Mastering courses, special videos, and mix consultations with me and soon exclusive giveaways of plugins, headphones, and a lot more. All right, Lifeline Expands by Excite Audio. Like I said, new brand, new plugin. I used to shy away from multi-effect plugins because back in the years, they didn't have too much control over each module and I'm a control freak. But the new generation of multi-effects, we've seen some on the channel, not only give you all the control that you want for each module, but they have some really high quality effect in them. And this one really got my attention for two out of the five module that it has, but they all sound great. And those two are the saturator called Dirt here, the first one, and Reamp. And also format is really cool, but we'll see that in a minute. You will hear specifically how Dirt, the saturator module, which by the way, like all the other module has several different algorithm of distortion and saturation in this case, is particularly smooth. In fact, smoothness and less digital artifact, unless you go for digital distortion on purpose, is the characteristic that I feel separates this one from other alike. So first I will do a quick pass of all the modules using the same synth pad, and then we'll go into detail. Every module and effect has a main and an advanced panel. Right now I'm just gonna use the main. You can see simple controls here. You select the algorithm, the drive, so the amount, the tone, and the mix with the dry source, all right? Let's start with Tube, my favorite. Like I said, it's my favorite. I wanted to start with this because that sets the tone for the quality of this plugin, I think. Reamp, really quick. All right, this one simulate reamping through uh, several different devices, a radio, a cabinet, monitors, vintage tape, or VCR. I didn't want to go into the advanced tabs this quickly, but with this module, I kind of have to because it's really cool what they did with this. Basically, for each device, you have two microphones, the close and the room, and a blend knob between the two. So listen how cool this is. When you start combining these modules and we have a width, a space, a format, we will see that in a minute, it gives you really cool effect and effects like this, I cannot have enough. Fuzzbox is one of my favorite. We have speakers. Uh, I have another one, a new one, which is an old Russian radio called Wires that is really cool. But I feel effects like this is what allows me to create uh, my unique delays and reverb or special vocals or treat background vocals, guitars, synths, bells, you name it. All right, let's go quick to the next, which is with.
quick and simple clean sound in module to expand and manipulate your stereo field with three different types of width enhancing. You have a mono bass filter here in the advanced tab and also the balance to tilt the stereo image any way you want. Space, this is our reverb and ambient module and it sounds surprisingly good. Let's take a listen. I don't know about you, but this hall sounds really good to me. We have plate. They all sound really good to me. The spring doesn't really sound like a spring, but is a different kind of reverb and it can be actually interesting on vocals. Love the plate and the slap is basically just an utility, but it's really cool to have it in combination with everything else. In the advanced tab for this, we have pre-delay, we have the size, we have the stereo width, and also very useful, the duck, which will compress the reverb every time the dry signal is present. Let's do it with the hall. very useful on vocals you also have you saw me tweaking it a filter a bandpass filter for uh, the space module format format is digital distortion okay very different from the dirt which is the analog saturation this one is really cool for special effect that synth is not really the best to showcase that module so I'm gonna switch to a loop really quick and here we have degrade resample flatten and washed washed being the most interesting you will hear it all these are digital types of distortion and degradation so obvious effect but when tucked in on some material they can actually give a bite and a color without being too intrusive The wash is really interesting. I can't think of any other plugin that sounds like this particular algorithm. It's really cool on synths and glitch sounds. But let's start taking a look at the advanced panel. We've seen some of them already. For example, in the washed, we have, again, just like the dirt. I'm going to put it here next to it. By the way, you can see you can change the sequence of all the modules just by clicking and dragging, okay? We have the same control, smooth, in the dirt, so in the analog saturator. Let's start with the format because this smooth knob is really what caught my attention here.
here what it does here it just made me like the flatten algorithm a lot more it basically just what it says on the it smooths out the digital artifacts and it makes the sound a lot more pleasant while keeping in this case the digital degradation but the smooth control is really what made me like the saturator of this plugin so much and here we have two knobs that are important the dynamic so it makes the saturation responding dynamically to the material and the smooth again let's drive the tube Here you also have a general mix knob. So if the balance of all the modules is, is at a level that you like, and a, a relationship that you like, you can just back off the overall effect with this. It actually has some really well done presets, so I'm gonna uh, scroll through some of them. Keys, we have ambient belts. Let's see without first. That's really cool. See, combining the modules, it's key because we heard them one by one, which is okay, but when you start combining is uh, the real power of this plugin. Listen here, the reamp, which could not be one of the sexiest if you listen to it by itself, but combining with everything else, it gives these belts like color. Really cool, and even automating stuff like the blend between the two mics for this, it, it just, it's a different way to pan things and to position in 3D. I wasn't expecting this to be so fun, but it really is. All right, I'm just scrolling through presets. They're really, really interesting. They're really well done. Let's try like on a baseline like this. And with this, I'm sold. <laughs> Listen to this bass.
damn man that sounds cool uh what we have format dirt and reamp see this is i like to study even when when there are presets well done you just sit and study what they did this is a really cool sound a lot comes from the degrade no smooth no anything and then let's turn this off dirt of course the fuzz one of my favorite effects on bass no smoothing no anything this is really nasty i love it and then reamp a cabinet of course which you can back off if you want a more in your face sound all right let's try some other 808 presets Hands down, this is my new favorite uh, growth box distortion fuzz box for 808 and synth bass. These sounds are pretty damn amazing. Let's try on drums and some stuff. Dude, that. Uh, space module uh, reverb sounds really good. I love it. I really love it. And it's the first time that I have like fun just running through presets. We have some two bus preset, basic guitar, vocals. Let's let's hear on vocals. Feel that isolation. I try to shine because you say you need a star. But you keep snuffing up the light of my spark. Won't you put me in your heart? We hide what we truly are. I'll meet you in the dark I'll meet you in the dark I feel that isolation I try to shine Cause you say you need a star But you keep snuffing up the light of my spark Won't you put me in your heart We hide what we truly are I'll meet you in the dark this reverb alone sounds really, really good. Uh, anyway, there's so much you can do with this plugin from synths, vocals, drums, we heard that. And it's very efficient. There's enough tweaking to get you infinite amount of sounds, but not enough that you tweak endlessly without uh, making a decision. So this was Excite Audio Lifeline Expense. Link is gonna be in the info box down below and it's on sale at the time of this video. I just got this myself. I hope the video was useful. I hope you liked it. And if you did, please don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Grab some merch down below. We have t-shirts, hoodies, mugs, pillows, whatever. Subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe. See you next time. Hands on my neck, hands get my throat, throat. Lift me up, up.